Aokigahara Forest, situated at the northwest base of Mount Fuji in Japan, is renowned for its dense vegetation, eerie atmosphere, and tragic association with suicide. This forest, also known as the Sea of Trees or the Suicide Forest, spans approximately 30 square kilometers, 12 square miles, and is characterized by its thick canopy of trees, rocky terrain, and caves formed by ancient lava flows. Despite its natural beauty and ecological significance, Aokigahara has gained notoriety as one of the world's most popular sites for suicides. The reasons behind this grim association are complex, but factors such as its remote location, dense foliage offering privacy, and cultural significance in Japanese mythology have contributed to its reputation. Efforts have been made to address the issue of suicide in Aokigahara Forest. Signs with messages of hope and encouragement are posted throughout the area, urging individuals to seek help and reconsider their actions. Volunteer patrols and counselling services are also provided to offer support to those in distress. Despite these efforts, Aokigahara remains a haunting place, attracting both curious visitors and those contemplating suicide. Its dark reputation juxtaposed with its natural beauty creates a complex and somber atmosphere that continues to intrigue and disturb people around the world. Zhangjiajie National Forest Park, located in the Hunan province of China, is renowned for its stunning natural beauty and unique geological formations. The park covers an area of over 1,500 square kilometers, 580 square miles, and is part of the larger Wulingyuan Scenic Area, a UNESCO World Heritage Site. What sets Zhangjiajie apart are its towering sandstone pillars, often shrouded in mist, which inspired the floating mountain landscapes in the movie Avatar. These surreal formations are the result of erosion over millions of years, creating a landscape unlike any other. Visitors to Zhangjiajie National Forest Park can explore its network of hiking trails, which wind through lush forests, past crystal clear streams, and offer breathtaking viewpoints of the towering peaks. The most famous spot is perhaps the glass-bottomed Zhangjiajie Grand Canyon Skywalk, which offers a thrilling experience walking over a deep gorge. The park's diverse flora and fauna add to its allure, with rare plant species and wildlife calling the area home. Throughout the park, visitors can encounter macaques, colorful birds, and other creatures amidst the dense foliage. Zhangjiajie National Forest Park is not only a natural wonder, but also holds cultural significance, with several temples and shrines scattered throughout the area. Iguazu Falls, located on the border between Brazil and Argentina, is one of the most awe-inspiring natural wonders in the world. This magnificent waterfall system consists of approximately 275 individual falls spread across a width of 2.7 kilometers, 1.7 miles, along the Iguazu River. The name Iguazu comes from the Guarani or Tupi words meaning big water, and indeed, the falls are a breathtaking display of the sheer power and beauty of nature. The most famous of these falls is the Devil's Throat, Garganta del Diablo in Spanish or Garganta do Diablo in Portuguese, a U-shaped 82-meter, 269-foot high waterfall that is the largest and most imposing of them all. The surrounding rainforest, known as the Atlantic Forest, adds to the allure of Iguazu Falls, providing a lush backdrop to the cascading waterfalls. This biodiverse ecosystem is home to a rich variety of plant and animal species, including colorful butterflies, exotic birds, and elusive jaguars. Visitors to Iguazu Falls can explore the area via a network of walkways and trails, offering various vantage points to view the falls from different angles. Boat tours also provide a thrilling experience, allowing visitors to get up close to the base of the falls and feel the spray of the cascading water. 
Both Brazil and Argentina offer spectacular views of Iguazu Falls, each providing unique perspectives of this natural wonder. The Brazilian side offers panoramic views of the falls from a distance, while the Argentine side allows visitors to get closer to the individual falls and explore the surrounding rainforest in more detail. The Cliffs of Moha, located on the western coast of Ireland in County Clare, are one of the most iconic natural landmarks in the country. Rising dramatically from the Atlantic Ocean, these sheer cliffs stretch for about 14 kilometers, 8.7 miles, along the coastline and reach heights of up to 214 meters, 702 feet, above sea level at their highest point. The cliffs offer breathtaking panoramic views of the rugged coastline, the vast expanse of the Atlantic Ocean and the Aran Islands in the distance. On a clear day, visitors can even see as far as the mountains of Connemara to the north and the Dingle Peninsula to the south. Aside from their stunning natural beauty, the cliffs of Moha are also home to a diverse array of seabirds, including puffins, guillemots, razorbills and kittiwakes. The cliffs provide nesting sites and habitat for these birds, making it a haven for bird watchers and nature enthusiasts. Visitors to the Cliffs of Mohair can explore the various viewing platforms and walking trails that offer different perspectives of the cliffs and surrounding landscape. The most popular vantage point is O'Brien's Tower, a historic stone tower built in the 19th century, which provides panoramic views of the cliffs and the Atlantic Ocean. In addition to its natural beauty, the Cliffs of Moher have been featured in numerous films, television shows and works of literature, further enhancing their cultural significance. They are also designated as a UNESCO Global Geopark due to their geological importance and unique rock formations. Cappadocia National Park, situated in central Turkey, is renowned for its extraordinary landscapes, surreal rock formations and rich cultural heritage. The region's unique geological features, shaped by volcanic eruptions and erosion over millions of years, have created a landscape unlike any other. The most distinctive feature of Cappadocia is its fairy chimneys, tall cone-shaped rock formations that dot the landscape. These formations, also known as hudus, or Peribakalura in Turkish, were formed by the erosion of soft volcanic rock topped with harder basalt, creating otherworldly spires and pinnacles. Throughout history, people have carved homes, churches, and even entire underground cities into the soft rock of Cappadocia, creating an extensive network of caves and tunnels. These cave dwellings served as shelters for early Christians fleeing persecution, and the region is dotted with ancient churches adorned with intricate frescoes dating back centuries. One of the most iconic experiences in Cappadocia is a hot air balloon ride over the surreal landscape at sunrise or sunset. From the air, visitors can marvel at the breathtaking vistas of fairy chimneys, valleys and rock formations stretching as far as the eye can see. Easter Island, known locally as Rapa Nui, is a remote island located in the southeastern Pacific Ocean, belonging to Chile. Renowned for its enigmatic Moai statues, Easter Island is one of the most mysterious and captivating destinations in the world. The island is famous for its colossal stone statues, called Moai, which were carved by the Rapa Nui people centuries ago. These are statues, some reaching heights of over 30 feet, 9 meters, and weighing up to 80 tons, were placed on ceremonial platforms known as Ahu. The Moai are believed to represent ancestors or important figures in Rapa Nui society, and their creation and transportation remain a marvel of ancient engineering and craftsmanship. Aside from the Moai, Easter Island boasts stunning natural beauty, including pristine beaches, volcanic craters, and rugged coastline. The island's volcanic origins are evident in its landscape, with extinct volcanoes such as Rano Kau and Rano Raraku adding to its allure. 
Visitors to Easter Island can explore its archaeological sites, including the famous Moai at Ahu Tongariki, Ahu Akivi, and the quarry at Rano Raraku, where most of the statues were carved. The island also offers opportunities for hiking, snorkeling and diving, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in its natural wonders. The Great Pyramid of Giza, also known as the Pyramid of Khufu or the Pyramid of Cheops, is one of the most iconic and enduring monuments of ancient Egypt. It is the largest of the three pyramids located on the Giza Plateau, just outside Cairo, Egypt. Built over 4,500 years ago during the Fourth Dynasty of the Old Kingdom, the Great Pyramid was constructed as a tomb for the Pharaoh Khufu, Cheops. It was originally clad in smooth, white limestone casing stones that reflected the sun's rays, giving it a brilliant appearance. Today, only a few of these casing stones remain at the base of the pyramid, as most were removed over the centuries for use in other construction projects. The Great Pyramid stands at a height of approximately 138.8 metres, 455 feet, and was the tallest man-made structure in the world for over 3,800 years until the construction of the Lincoln Cathedral in England in the 14th century. It is composed of an estimated 2.3 million limestone blocks, each weighing between 2.5 and 15 tonnes, and was constructed with remarkable precision considering the tools and technology available at the time. The interior of the Great Pyramid contains a series of passageways, chambers and corridors, including the King's Chamber and the Queen's Chamber. The purpose of these chambers remains a subject of debate among historians and archaeologists, with theories ranging from religious rituals to astronomical alignments. Stonehenge, located in Wiltshire, England, is one of the most famous prehistoric monuments in the world. This ancient site consists of a circular arrangement of large standing stones, each weighing up to 25 tonnes, set within earthworks. The exact purpose and meaning of Stonehenge remain a subject of debate among historians, archaeologists and researchers. It is believed to have been constructed in multiple phases, beginning around 5,000 years ago during the late Neolithic period and continuing into the Bronze Age. The most recognisable feature of Stonehenge is the outer circle of standing stones known as sarsens, which are toppered with lintel stones forming a ring. In cedar, this outer circle is a horseshoe arrangement of smaller blue stones, which are believed to have been transported from the Priscelli Hills in Wales, over 150 miles away. Stonehenge is aligned with the movements of the sun and moon, leading many to speculate that it was used as an ancient astronomical observatory, or for religious and ceremonial purposes. Some theories suggest that it served as a temple for worship, a burial site, or a place for healing rituals. The precise significance of the site to its builders remains shrouded in mystery. Similarly to Stonehenge in England, Mary Hill Stonehenge in Washington State, USA, is a replica of the famous prehistoric monument. Mary Hill Stonehenge was built as a memorial to the fallen soldiers of World War I and is slightly smaller than the original Stonehenge. However, both structures share similar features, such as the arrangement of standing stones in a circular pattern. It is intriguing to consider that at one time, the original Stonehenge may have looked much like Mary Hill Stonehenge before succumbing to the ravages of time and destruction. The Grand Canyon, located in the state of Arizona, USA, is one of the most breathtaking natural wonders on Earth. Carved by the Colorado River over millions of years, the Grand Canyon is a massive gorge that stretches for approximately 277 miles, 446 kilometers, and reaches depths of over a mile, 1.6 kilometers. The canyon's sheer size, intricate rock formations, and stunning colors make it a mesmerizing sight to behold. 
layers of sedimentary rock shaped by the forces of erosion, reveal millions of years of Earth's geological history, creating a natural masterpiece unlike any other. Visitors to the Grand Canyon can explore its rim via scenic overlooks, hiking trails and viewpoints, offering panoramic vistas of the canyon and the Colorado River below. Popular activities include hiking, rafting, camping and wildlife viewing, allowing visitors to immerse themselves in the canyon's natural beauty and rugged wilderness. In addition to its natural allure, the Grand Canyon holds cultural significance for Native American tribes who have inhabited the region for thousands of years. The canyon's vastness and spiritual power have inspired myths, legends, and artwork among indigenous peoples, adding to its rich cultural heritage. Machu Picchu, located high in the Andes Mountains of Peru, is one of the most iconic archeological sites in the world. This ancient Inca citadel, built in the 15th century, is nestled on a mountain ridge above the sacred valley, offering breathtaking views of the surrounding peaks and lush cloud forests. The exact purpose of Machu Picchu remains a subject of debate among historians and archeologists, but it is believed to have served as a royal estate or sacred religious site for the Inca Emperor Pachacuti. Constructed using intricate dry stone techniques, Machu Picchu features well-preserved buildings, terraces and plazas, showcasing the remarkable engineering and architectural skills of the Inca civilization. Visitors to Machu Picchu can explore its labyrinthine streets, climb to the top of Huayna Picchu or Machu Picchu Mountain for panoramic views, and marvel at the precision and craftsmanship of its stone structures. The site's most famous landmarks include the Temple of the Sun, the Intihuatana Stone, believed to be an ancient sundial, and the Temple of the Three Windows. Machu Picchu's remote location and mysterious abandonment by the Inca make it a captivating and enigmatic destination. Although the site was never revealed to the Spanish conquistadors and remained unknown to the outside world for centuries, it was rediscovered by American explorer Hiram Bingham in 1911, sparking global fascination with the lost city of the Incas.